stargazer. Ooh, we've got a blue here. And this is a shimmer and a sheen as well. Looks like we've got a beautiful, maybe a bluish. Let's just shake it up and grab the swatch card and see what we've got. All right. So it's a very, very deep blue, almost a black. It's really beautiful and it's very, very thick, which could be from both of that sheen and the shimmer there. And let's go ahead and test it out. It writes nicely, flows off the pen well. We'll write the name here. Stargazer. So it's gonna be a little galactic, let's hope. It's already starting to dry, so I really can't wait to see what this one looks like. Let's put it off to the side and grab our other journals. We've got the Nemesine here, and we'll swatch it out again. See, it's so dark right there, but you can see that blue. It's like a really, really dark, dark navy. I do like that. Let's try it out on the Rhodia here. It paints out beautifully. It starts to dry a little bit towards the end. Look how fast it's drying. That's crazy. This is cool. All right, we'll grab our Hobonichi here and we'll write the name first. Whoops, it's getting harder to write the labels because there's not as many pages on this one side here. So we'll hold it up a little bit so we can get a flatter surface. And we will paint this one out as well. I just can't get over how dark this blue is. Almost like a black blue. Very beautiful. Looking forward to see how this one dries. So we'll go ahead and finish up there, put it off to the side, and be back in a jiffy. All right, here we go. Wow, look at that. You can see that almost the reddish um, is the sheen, and it really sheens on the writing, which is cool. And then you see that just hint of shimmer there. Um, so I don't know if it's like a blue or like a greenish shimmer. It's really cool looking, but you really have that sheen. Um, that shows a lot. And then you've got the, the blue there. So very cool ink and um, a little bit of bleed through. Again, I put it on pretty thick. Let's go ahead and try it on the Rhodia. Um, so you can see just lots of that sheening and then the shimmer too. And I'm really surprised it did not bleed through on the back side because I did put a lot on there. So that's interesting. Now we'll go ahead and grab our Hobonichi and look at this. Like the entire page is just sheen. Sheen with like bits of that uh, glitter. You barely see any of the blue and none of it bled through, which really surprises me. Um, so this is definitely an interesting ink. Um, here they are side by side. It's kind of hard to tell. Like I think the Nemesis might be a little bit darker, um, but you can't even tell because the sheen is so crazy there. So let's go ahead and grab our chromatography and see what that reveals for us. All right, I've got my little journal here, which is getting so full. And here we go. Ta-da! The big reveal. So we have all of our shimmer there down at the bottom. And then there's lots of like green well, I mean, mostly blue, but then there's hints of that green, but seriously, this chromatography just looked like it could go on and on and on. So let's put that off to the side. I'm really interested to play with this ink today. So there was our party time of a page yesterday. We will go ahead and flip to a new page. We'll grab our washi tape as always. We will leave a little bit of a border around the outside to give us that nice finished look. I will speed up the video, add some lovely music, and I will check back with you at the end. So please enjoy the video.
one, like this one, is a snowstorm with all of those splatters on there. It was fun to do the different layers. We got hints of um, green in that top layer, um, which was really fun to play with and try and pull out. And uh, yeah, just lots of blues. And hopefully I didn't make you too sick spinning that journal around so many times. But let's go ahead, close up our inkwell, and I will bring this up a little bit closer here for you to see. So we got some like almost like a greenish gray, some darker layers. Um, it was fun. We played with that white ink again to create that snow feel. Um, so yeah, this one was a lot of fun and I really enjoyed painting it with you today. So there we go. One more day in our Inkvent journal complete. Again, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me, me and my inky fingers. It's been such a joy to have you paint along with me. So until we paint again. Happy creating.